Thank you. Since the chairman has gaveled out all of my colleagues with their unanimous consent, I am going to read for the record many of the chairman's comments uh, in September of the importance of hearing from the whistleblower. Again, Ambassador, thank you for your patience, thank you for your service, but since we haven't been able to conduct ourselves in normal procedures, I'm just going to use the five minutes for this. September 29th, in the Wall Street Journal, quote, the whistleblower at the center of the impeachment investigation of President Trump will testify in the House very soon. This is a quote by the chairman. USA Today, September 29th. Talking with ABC News this week, Schiff, the Democrat who chairs the House Intelligence Committee, said the whistleblower would testify very soon. And the only thing standing in the way was getting security clearances for the attorneys representing the whistleblower so they could attend the testimony. From Vox, September 29th, Rep. Adam Schiff said Sunday the whistleblower at the center of a growing scandal surrounding President Donald Trump will testify before the House Intelligence Committee very soon. On CNN, September 29th, Schiff said Sunday on ABC as well as NBC's Meet the Press that he expects the whistleblower to testify very soon. The Washington Post, sep September 29th, in an appearance on ABC News this week, Schiff echoed Pelosi's message. He also said he expected the Intelligence Committee to hear from the whistleblower very soon, pending a security clearance from Acting Director of National Intelligence, Joseph McGuire. In the Huffington Post, Schiff told ABC's this week that he expects the whistleblower to appear before this committee very soon. In the New York Post, quote, we'll get the unfiltered testimony of that whistleblower. In the Washington Times, quote, that whistleblower will be allowed to come in. These are all quotes from Chairman Adam Schiff. In Talking Points memo, the question was posed, actually this was by George Stephanopoulos, have you reached an agreement yet with the whistleblower and his or her attorneys about coming before the committee and providing the information firsthand? Quote, yes we have, Schiff responded, and as DNI McGuire promised during the hearing, that whistleblower will be allowed to come in and come in without a minder from the Justice Department or from the White House to tell the whistleblower what they can and cannot say. We'll get the unfiltered testimony of that whistleblower. In Daily Coast, we're ready to hear from the whistleblower as soon as that is done, and we'll keep obviously riding shotgun to make sure that the acting director doesn't delay in that clearance process. In CNBC, we'll get the unfiltered testimony of that whistleblower. In Market Watch, House Intelligence Committee Chairman Adam Schiff said Sunday that an agreement has been reached under which the whistleblower will testify before the committee very soon. I can keep going, but again, the chairman refused to uh, allow us to put these into the record with unanimous consent. So I've read those out, and as we know, it is important to protect whistleblowers from retaliation and from firing, and we want to make sure whistleblowers are able to come forward. But in this case, the fact that we are getting criticized by Chairman Adam Schiff for statements that he himself made early on in this process shows the duplicity and just the abuse of power that we are continuing to see. With a minute 54 seconds left, I'll yield to my colleague, Mr. Jordan.